Hey Collective, today we're going to do a quick energy check-in to see if we can get some messages. To my returning subscribers, welcome back. And to anybody who's new here, thank you for joining us today. If you are interested in a personal reading, you can check the description box down below. I just want to thank everybody for your likes, your subscribes, your shares, and all your sweet messages on the support of the channel and of one another. And we're just going to go ahead and hop right into the reading. Now there's a lot of messages coming out, so we're going to go ahead and take all of these. Let's see. So somebody could be losing money. This could be somebody that you rejected. This is dirt digging. I don't know what direction that one came out in because I think it spun around when I touched it. Um, there's something here about somebody having to give money and something about someone else winning something. Whoever this is could be someone who has a lot of bad habits that they are trying to get rid of. Um, let's see. So what I'm seeing from this is somebody could be spending a lot of money or having to give you money because you end up winning something. Whoever this person is, you may not notice what's going on in their life at this time, but they could be someone who is trying to clean up their act or do something where they stop indulging in some sort of a bad habit. Um, but this could have to do with maybe karma that this person is receiving at this time, or they could be losing a lot of money. So someone is in despair. There's something here about imprisonment. So this person could be feeling trapped or they could be in jail at this time or they could be concerned about having to go to jail or they could... There's something here about someone having to give you money or losing money around something that's related to whatever this energy is around you. There's a change here, and this person could be messaging you soon. There's something about a community of people or somebody that this person is working with or someone that this person is in a partnership with. They could be paying this person something. I'm starting to get a specific message. Um, for some of you, there's something about this person paying an attorney or someone something and whatever they're give, like putting into this it's not working they're being rejected they're not getting what they want out of it and there's something about them stopping a toxic behavior or realizing that they need to stop a toxic behavior because you are not phased by whatever this has to do with you could have been in a relationship with this person or in some sort of a partnership with this person this could have had to do with the business At the bottom of this deck is false person. So let's see what else comes out. <laughs> so what I'm seeing here <laughs> is that your energy, it's, it's healed or you are healing. And it's bringing in an ending to whatever this has to do with. You being unfazed by whatever this is is causing this person to realize no matter what time, money, energy they dump into whatever this has to do with, it's not touching you. They feel trapped by this. They could be physically trapped. So for some of you, there is something about incarceration here. This could have happened around um, a car. Somebody could have gone to jail recently over something where they've gotten pulled over. Um, you could be an Aquarius or a Scorpio or have those signs in your chart or be dealing with somebody who has those signs in their chart. But there's something about you being in the spotlight or being seen or your energy being recognized. And this is bringing in an ending. For some of you, this is just simply this person recognizing your energy. They're seeing that you're 
not phased by what it is that they're doing. Whatever this has to do with, this person is losing a lot of money. It looks like there's been a lot of fighting. The change that could be coming through could have something to do with this person. Um, hang on, let me just... Yeah. What I'm seeing is this person being in a state of no longer wanting to fight with you. They're no longer wanting to be in direct competition with you because they feel like this is causing them a financial loss. They're ready to move on from whatever this has to do with. They could be messaging you soon. What is this message about? This message... <laughs> this message could have to do with something to do with this person and a karmic feminine. They could be looking at a situation from a different perspective. That This karmic and whoever this person is, they could live in a home together. That so You could be dealing with a Pisces or an Aries or have this sign somewhere in your chart. They could be connected to a Sagittarius or you could have that sign somewhere in your chart. Or this could be a Sagittarius somewhere in here. For some of you, the message that they're going to be sending you is going to have something to do with them deciding to leave this person that they're with. Or there's some, there's an energy shift here. This person could be trying to come back towards you. Wanting to work on the connection after a period of being really greedy or selfish with you because they see that you're getting a new beginning and they feel like they've they, they're they in regret about whatever it is that's going on so there's a lot of energy of despair here show me the star you you have healed and You've gotten through a lot of pain. There's something about you <laughs> working on yourself and your money at this time. There's something about this is like a big, um, it's like a heavy burden on this person's mind about how you are healing, how whatever it is that you're doing right now is, it's putting them in their head. There's something about, yeah, and the Ace of Swords has just come out, so that's, I'm on the right track with whatever this is. There's something about you healing from pain that they have caused you. <laughs> and this is you healing and working on yourself and working on your money. And this is giving this person anxiety <laughs> about sneaky behavior that they have indulged in. This person could have lied, cheat, or cheated on you or stolen from you. Whatever it is that they, if somebody took something from you, whether this was your energy or money, they've run out of whatever this is. There's something about this person losing whatever it is that they have earned off of you. So, for some of you, if this person got into a relationship with somebody who was karmic to them, and maybe they did this off of something that belonged to you or something that they should have given, I'm getting ill-gotten gains. So something that somebody did where they used whatever it was that belonged to you to start a new relationship. So this could be anything. This could be money that they were supposed to give you and they started, you know, a new relationship with somebody and made purchases with that money or they stole something from you and made purchases. Whatever it is that they have invested in, it's like, the place that they have poured their, themselves into, they're not happy there and they've lost money and energy dealing with whatever this is. It's run out. And this person sees that you are, you've worked on yourself and that you've healed from whatever this pain is that they've caused you. The pain that they caused you could have been around something to do with a community of people or for some of you that this person did something around your job.
And whatever this delusion is that they've been in there, it's like they're moving on from this. There's a cycle that's closing out here because this person is reaping what they have sown whenever it comes to, this could have been a divorce. Um, there could be some legal contract that's here that this person is gonna be reaping what they, whatever it is that they've sown in the justice system. You could be dealing with a Taurus or a Libra or have those signs somewhere in your chart. But this self-delusion that this person is in, it's like there something has happened. There has been some sort of an energy shift and this person is being violently shoved into an ending. It's like they're seeing that they have to move on from this. This person could be an air sign. This could be an Aquarius, Libra, or a Gemini. You could have children with this person. You could work with this person. There could be a father figure here that has something to do with this. There's also a Sagittarius that this is highlighting that could be very toxic. There's something too about Someone is very confused about whether they want to heal or they want to continue to stay toxic. It's like they're seeing something now. There's something that they're seeing very clearly. They've had an epiphany or some sort of a breakthrough. And now it's like they know that they have to, because they've been knocked out of whatever this silliness is that they've been in, whatever this delusion they've been in. I don't know if this person has suddenly gotten sober. I don't know if they are having sobering thoughts because something is happening to them around their finances. It's like something isn't funny anymore and they're realizing something. They've had an epiphany. This could have had to do with some communication that you recently had with them. It could have to do with something that they're losing. It's like the only thing that is waking them up is that they have lost something. This person could have lost a job. They could have lost a great deal of money. <laughs> This person, um, there's also Capricorn here with Sagittarius and Virgo and Gemini. Whatever they were doing, it had something to do with manifesting wealth. And they betrayed you to do this. And out of this betrayal, you have had some sort of a win. And this is causing this person to be in a lot of pain around money that they were being very greedy with. This person could have done a lot of things to be emotionally manipulative and, um, let me see the way that I want to say this. For some of you, this person was with somebody or this could be them, but the energy that I'm seeing is somebody who's very, um, needy or whiny or irritating or very codependent or just like sucking the life out of energy that's near them because of money and causing a lot of anxiety <laughs> and something that they were doing they were trying to cast a shadow like what they were doing was for the best interest of something like they were doing something pretending to operate from an emotionally balanced place but they were doing something in a very manipulative way to do with emotions and communication because of money. Um, for others of you, this is time or energy. There's something around children that this could have had to do with and boundaries. There's a new beginning that's coming in and this person is gonna be trying to come in to speak to you because you have your back turned to them. You may be getting a break from this person at this time. There's something about the energy being stagnant. Let's see. There is some sort of an end to fighting that I'm seeing. It's like this person is, whatever they've been doing to be combative or to be in competition with you, there's something about them wanting to end that or <laughs> there's about to be a transformation around that specifically 
but it's not because of anything other than whatever they've stolen from you or whatever they had. It's like they have lost it and now they feel like they have to come to you for, for help. Yeah, they're looking at something from a different perspective because of feeling trapped. They're going to try to come back towards you in a very passionate way. They could be messaging you something soon. This could have to do with... Um, it's something around fighting. So whatever this has to do with, this person could try to disguise an apology around... This person could come in and try to tell you that the reason that they did all of these things to you is because they were just hurt over the connection with you, over your marriage, over your new beginning. You do have justice coming towards you. Along with whatever this is. For some of you, this is the justice, this is the karma, this person coming out of this fog and realizing that what they have... What they had when they left from you came from you. So it's like they were able to steal it, but it ran out because they're not the ones that are creating whatever this is. This person could try to apologize to you. They're going to try to apologize to you and say that they are healed. There's something about them. For some of you, this may not even, it may not be an apology. This is something about them having to acknowledge your light, acknowledge your energy, acknowledge that you were unfazed, that you are the one that's winning whatever this has to do with. And a lot of you are not in competition with this person. This just, just has to do with, it's like they've been doing something in a very hateful manner and they've been doing it and they've been in a delusion while they have been doing whatever this has to do with. So for some of you, I'm getting this person is um, like this is an addict of some kind who maybe they're coming and they're having to do a 12 step program. For others of you, this is somebody who's just all of a sudden stopped drinking or for others of you, this has something to do with um, they they're losing something this could be them just losing it life in general. Maybe they've lost their job. Maybe they spent money on something to do with somebody that they are paying. And they are feeling rejected and it's causing them. Yeah, it's causing them to, to see something clearly. It's causing them to have an epiphany or a breakthrough. And there's something about them having to give you something that they've tried to keep from you whenever they were moving away. This person could end up in, in a depression if they aren't already there. They feel defeated, whoever this is. They feel like what they worked on just brought them to a place of defeat and now they feel stupid. Oh, my battery is dying. They know that this sneaky behavior has brought in a tower for them. Whatever they did around lying and cheating and stealing and there's a victory here for you. You've got energy or mess messages coming towards you around something to do with finances or wealth that you haven't been able to see. There's also something about a wish fulfillment and your emotional fulfillment. And there's an ending here. Transformation is here. So there's an energy shift and you could be receiving messages from somebody soon from someone who has been fighting with you. And they're having some sort of epiphany 
And this could have to do with karma that this person is receiving. So I'm going to go ahead and end the message there. I hope this message was helpful. Thank you.